also great to see you back here in the UK. Uh, back on Sunday, yeah. you're back at the Wigan game. How are you? Yeah, I'm good. It was a long day of travel on Sunday. Uh, I got delayed a few times and made it for the second half and uh, you know sat with the fans, which is always a cool experience. I did it once before and just to see how passionate everyone is about the team and also just for me to, to see the team play again. You know, it's I've obviously been away for a few months trying to get myself right uh, to get fit and you know now I really feel like I'm at a, at a place where I to come back and finish my end stage rehab here and with the medical staff and, and get back to playing hopefully so how, how are you feeling physically i feel great i was working with a really good pt in uh, la holly silvers and you know she's really got me on a great path and um got over that initial disappointment of being injured again which you know i'd uh, obviously not anticipated and you know after i get over that setback i was just fully focused on getting fit and getting myself back on the pitch and that's what my last five months have been dedicated towards and i'm you know i'm really happy with my progress and uh how everything's going one thing we can't fault is, is your spirit you know you keep coming back don't you <laughs> yeah i'm not gonna give up you know so whoever keeps injuring me or you know, if I keep getting knocked down, you know, I have one, no one thing for sure that I'll always get up and I'll fight until, uh, you know, I'm medically told I can never play football again. As, but as far as my body goes, I feel fantastic and, you know, my head's in the right place and uh, I'm really ready now just to, 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 to get that last little effort to, to get me over the line. So this is it now, you kind of step in the final stage of your rehab, if you will? Yeah, I guess final stage is, uh, is used you know loosely but um yeah i've still got a bit of strength work to do a bit of plyometric work um but as far as my running and my sprinting and all that stuff i've been building that up over the last couple months and i think i'm really far ahead in, the, in that respect so it's just going to be uh you know fine touches and you know i'm not really sure how how long it's going to take but i know that i'll do the work necessary to, to get it done also great to see i'm guessing also great to see your teammates as well i mean provide a bit of a boost for them as well yeah it was great to see the lads you know just to be involved in the banter again and give some guys some stick and um, you know especially to see Sparky play again I know he's going through obviously he went through what I'm going through now and I know how hard he's worked so that was you know rewarding for him to be back on the field and then obviously just to see all the guys and there's a few new players a few new faces faces around and you know I've tried to mix in as, as soon as possible I've only been back two days but you know I'm looking forward to being back uh, now for the rest of the season and also a quick word on the fans as well getting you uh, constant support from fans worldwide yeah, the, I th honestly, it's a big thing that drives me on is support from the fans and uh, in general, uh, both from Bolton and the United States. And, you know, the Bolton fans have been great. I know, obviously, they're as frustrated as I am and, you know, for like getting in picking up injuries and their long-term ones. But, you know, I can assure them and I think they know that I'm doing everything in my power to, to get back healthy and it's out of my control. But I really appreciate all their support and uh, words of encouragement because that really helps me keep going especially before Christmas because everyone knows how the holiday period is and you want to be happy and enjoy your family and um, you know Darien House goes a long way to helping that happen.